today I am going to be talking about my fall slash winter hair regimen. So let's let's just get right into it. Cause okay, so to start, I wash my hair once a month using this shampoo. It's the Trader Joe's Tea Tree Tingle Shampoo, and I wash my hair once a month or anytime I have a lot of residue. Um, so everything following my shampoo routine, I do. Um, but I also do a co-wash routine and to co-wash so after I shampoo my hair I usually use when now I also do this when I co-wash my hair which I do twice a week So I began by co-washing with my when and this is my co-wash. I do this twice a week. In the midweek when I do co-wash, I do not. So after I finish up with my one, what I do is an apple cider vinegar rinse. So right now I'm showing you how I do my apple cider vinegar rinse. That water bottle has a quarter cup of apple cider vinegar mixed with cold water that I keep in the refrigerator. And I just squirt that in my hair and I pretty much work it through. I let it sit about a minute and I rinse it out. The reason why I do an apple cider vinegar rinse is because it restores my hair natural pH. And when I start the deep conditioning process, it penetrates the deep conditioner so well that it will not leave my hair dry and I get the full benefits of my deep conditioner. I do deep condition with my Joyco deep conditioner underneath the steamer on my wash day, which is Sunday. Mm -hmm. Follow up, I always do a twist out, which I'm doing right now. What I do with the twist out is I always follow the LOC method. So the L is already the liquid that's in my hair. The oil, I use my everything butter. And I also use Jamaican black castor oil. Um, the reason why I use Jamaican black castor oil is for two reasons. One, my hair is extremely, extremely, extremely dry um, during these seasons. So I need as much moisture as possible. And two, um, I, I usually, this is the time of year where I experience a lot of breakage. Um, so this is going to help keep my hair moisturized. And I oil my hair every night. Um, and I keep it in this. So what I will do is um, throughout the week, if I need to refresh my twists, I use this mixture which is water, coconut oil, and glycerin and I'll spritz it on my hair continuing to do the LOC method throughout the week. I'll spritz it on my hair and I'll add this as my oil. So next when I do my twist out I'm doing the conditioner which is the lot of body. Um, moisturize, moisturize me curl and style mix. I'm loving this stuff. I am loving this stuff. So this is the last step in my LOC method. Another thing that I'm doing is drinking a lot, a lot, a lot of water. I drink a lot of water um, on a normal basis. Um, and these are the only products that I'm using in the winter time. The reason why I'm only using these products in the winter time is because this is the time my hair is dry and I'm experiencing breakage. And you know, dry hair leads to breakage. And I don't. In the winter time, I try to keep my regimen as simple as possible because what happens is your hair is not moisturized enough. You have to use products that you know are going to work for your hair. You have to use products that you know are going to be moisturizing for my hair. And for me, I know that all of these products are moisturizing for my hair. Um, and right now, I'm at four months post texturizer um, and I'm kind of going back and forth whether I want to texturize my hair again or whether I just want to transition back to being natural um, but I will let you guys know that probably um, June 2015 because that's when I'll be at one year post and that's when I really like make my decision um, so yeah so that is all of my products. Uh, my, like I said, my, my regimen is so, 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 so simple. There's no need for you to use a million and one product as long as the products work for you. So if you guys have any questions, feel free to 